We're blessed in the state of Florida to have a tremendous diversity of habitats and species, and those habitats and species support a tremendous natural resource-based economy. Everything from hunting to fishing to beach going, wildlife healing, and the management of those resources is the mission of FWC. It's important that that mission is backed by sound scientific data, and that's the mission of the Fish and Wildlife Research Institute. The science we develop that informs wise management of Florida's natural resources really focuses on a few areas. For harvested species, it's important that we continually track the amount harvested versus the status of the natural population. We want to make sure that regulations are in place that allow folks to hunt and fish, but also provide for the long-term sustainability of the resources. In Florida, we have a number of challenges associated with invasive species. Just because of the geographic location of the state and its accessibility to species coming in, either naturally or man-made, we have a number of invasive species in Florida that are causing significant risk to our native fish and wildlife. There's an opportunity there to get ahead of these species before they do too much damage to native fish and wildlife. The other area we focus on are native Florida species that may be in peril for some reason. A number of these species are recovering to the point where potentially they might be able to be delisted from certain threatened species lists. That's our goal as a scientific institute, is to provide that information that ultimately results in the recovery of those imperiled species. At FWRI, we put a lot of work into assessing the status of our state's habitats. And we have a diversity of habitats in Florida ranging from coral reefs to upland ecosystems to freshwater wetlands. Each of those habitats supports a wide diversity of species, either for wildlife viewing, hunting, or fishing. So the Research Institute's mission is very broad. We work on essentially all fish and wildlife in the state, from terrestrial wildlife to marine wildlife to freshwater wildlife, and all fisheries, both freshwater and marine. We bring in scientists and technical specialists with a range of expertise in a number of disciplines. Everything from economics to biology, to map making, to math, to statistics, all necessary to conduct after I scientific mission. The Institute's mission is supported by people who benefit from the work we do. Your hunting fees, your fishing license fees directly support work that ultimately assesses the species that you are interested in. The Institute has more than a 50 year history of partnering with other government agencies, academic groups, and federal government agencies. And a large portion of our budget is actually grant funded where funds come to the state to do work that benefits multiple agencies. It's important that as a scientific institution, FWRI communicates what we're doing real time and as transparently as possible to the public. One of the more effective tools we have to do that is our annual programs document which gives you an overview of the Institute and also highlights specific research work that ultimately is going to benefit wise management of our natural resources. Well, thank you for your interest in the Fish and Wildlife Research Institute. We're committed to continuing to develop the scientific data and information that supports wise management of Florida's natural resources. I encourage you to explore this program's document website. You'll find a diversity of information that touches on the range of programs we have statewide. If you find one that you're particularly interested, feel free to follow up with our staff at our headquarters in St. Petersburg or visit our website.